guys welcome back to my channel I decided to do something a little different for this video I'm gonna do kind of like a nighttime routine get on ready with me type of video it's Monday night so tomorrow I start my work week so it's about eight o'clock right now Amir is thankfully home tonight and putting the kids down for me so that I can film this video and usually on the nights that he's home he kind of gives me a break putting the kids down to sleep so we just finished watching some YouTube together in bed and now they're reading books. So I'm gonna take this opportunity <laughs> to take a shower. That's usually the first thing I do um, every Monday night before the start of a new work week. And then I'll show you guys my face routine. I'm gonna walk you through everything I use in the shower, my pajamas, just everything nighttime related. Amir and I kind of hang our towels and robes on um, this hook thingy. They're made for our doors, but this one kind of like gets jammed in our door when we hang it on our door. So we've just hung it on our bar hook above our closet here. So this is my white robe. I'm going to grab this. Um, that towel is Amir's. I'm going to get myself a new one in the closet out here. Cody so nicely sleeping. I'm here playing video games. Isaiah's down for bed. Can I tell them something? Sure. Actually, my dad won't like read me a book. Daddy's gonna come read you your book. But he, he only says five minutes. Yep, five minutes. He's gonna read you your, your library book. I'm gonna go take a shower and then I'll come say night to you after, okay? the door here. And now we're going to grab a fresh towel. Most of our towels are white and gray. lock it because I have children who like to come into the shower or the bathroom while I'm in here so I know I've said this in other vlogs but I'll show it again this is my face wash that I use in the shower it's Neutrogena it's okay I don't actually love this one um, I usually like to get the ones that have the little like micro beads inside I feel like I get a better cleanse with them but this one is okay I always get a gentle one though because I have sensitive skin Dove products are my favorite. Um, this is my favorite shampoo by them. So I've got the conditioner and then the shampoo. It smells like so fresh and clean. This is the one I use. Then I've got a few exfoliators up here. Tea tree one and then a Dove one. This is my loofah. Um, my shavers, this is an old one I actually need to toss. This one is the Flamingo one. And I just got new razor heads the other day at Target. So I'm definitely going to be using that in the shower. Um, this is what I buy at Mirror. The Dev Men Care. The Cool Fresh smells really good. And then this is my body wash that I'm using. This is the, where is it? Um, blue fig orange blossom scent I like any of them this was my old conditioner that's pretty much running out so I'm going to get fresh and clean my hair is like three days old here it's so greasy and my mascara is coming off my face it's been a long weekend so I can't wait to just shower get clean washing my face is one of the most relaxing things that I do at night I absolutely love the feeling of just fresh, clean skin.
door. All right. So I know a lot of you guys have seen this before, but I'll just show it quick. This is um, my makeup desk and my skincare stuff is off to the side here. This is actually a filing cabinet next to my makeup desk. So it makes it kind of like a longer surface area. Um, this is my electric hair removal. I have hair like on top of my lip and sometimes on my chin and my neck. So this, you just kind of turn it on. Turn it on and like the little shaver part at the top gets them. I use this usually in the morning. I just check everything quick and make sure I don't have any little stragglers hanging out. So that goes up here. I also keep like my tweezers and stuff in here, my eyebrow pencil, some scissors, some eye glue, um, my sponges for my face makeup. There's just makeup in all these drawers here. So over here, this is basically like my nighttime routine area. I'm gonna sit. Okay, so I'll show you guys everything over here. This is my hemp lotion that I'm going to grab first. I usually use this after the shower all over my legs and my arms. Um, just anywhere that feels dry, really. This stuff smells so good. It's fresh coconut and watermelon. I love, love, love this stuff. I think I got it at Marshall's. I forget. Oh, here it is. It was, it was only $10.99, which kind of seems like a lot for lotion, but it's a good price for the hemp lotion, I think. Um, so this I'm going to keep out because I'm about to lotion my legs. This a co-worker got for me while she was on vacation. It's Dream Moisturizing Lotion. It smells so good again and I usually use this during the daytime. Um, I just have my Dove Dry Shampoo back here. My Micellar Water. This is also something I'm going to pull right now. Um, at nighttime, if I don't take a shower at night, I usually use this to completely remove. I use it to completely remove all of my makeup on my face, but usually after a shower because that face wash that I showed you guys isn't the best. I have to use this to take off the residual mascara that you're already seeing under my eyes and there's probably still some left on my eyelashes. So that's what this is for. This is rose water. Again, I got it from Marshalls and I use this as kind of just a natural toner. Um, I spray it on my face in the morning before I apply my makeup just to hydrate um, until my face right before I start applying. And at nighttime, I use it after my micellar water before I start applying oils or moisturizer. Okay, so this first row here are all of my oils. This is a hydrating facial serum by Giovanni. Um, moisturizes, refreshes, and softens. This is very gentle on my skin. Um, this is definitely one of my favorites. Then I have these three. These are all by the same company called Valgene Labs. This one is Revive. It's vitamin C and peptides, and it's a day serum. So I'll put this on right before my makeup in the morning, right after I apply the rose water. This one is coconut rose it's a hydrating facial oil if my skin is feeling extra dry especially like now in the fall and winter i apply this underneath my moisturizer as you can see it's been well loved and well used and i definitely have to re-up on this um actually this one is for from pearlescence not from the same company as this one but they look the same and this one is another hydrating one um, hydraulic acid and vitamin B facial serum um, this is just another one it's not really my favorite but I do use it lastly is this beautiful facial serum this is by the company Teamy. it's a vitamin C tea infused serum got vitamin C and hibiscus infused in it it's a beautiful color and I got it about a month ago Teamy Blends was nice enough to offer all of my subscribers 15% off your orders using code McMull15. 
You can also get 25% off your orders of $39 or more. I'm going to put everything in the description box below. This stuff smells so good. It smells like fruit and tea. And I've been using it for a month straight, as you guys can see. It's whittling away here. I posted a story about me using this serum on my Instagram. And we're definitely going to be using this in our skincare routine tonight. Over here are my moisturizers. This is Aloe. It's a um, moisture cream, calming moisture cream, soothing essence. Um, it's basically almost 100% aloe cream. I'm going to use this after I use this serum just for a little bit extra hydration, but it's really gentle and soft on my skin. And I just like the way my skin feels the next morning when I put this on. This um, is another body cream. It's more of a body butter. I can use this all over my body. Sometimes I only use it on my face though. And again, I use this if my skin's feeling a little extra dry. Um, it just seems to do the trick and it was, I think it was like 20 or 30 bucks. This one was pretty expensive. Okay, I'm gonna set these aside for a second. We're gonna use our lotion here. I just shaved my legs finally. So, this is what I'm going to be using first all over my legs. Okay, I'm just putting the rest of the lotion on my hands. And then we're going to put this away. And we are definitely going to take care of all this mascara under here. I use um, waterproof mascara. Because um, if I don't, I always like just completely rubs off so so we're just gonna take one of these target cotton swabs here and I soak it and then I put it on my eye and I kind of just pat it into my eyeball I let it soak there for a minute and let the oils kind of work and then I start rubbing get under the eye And that usually takes it all off. Just clean it up a little bit. Go over my eyebrows again. Okay. So one more time. A little bit more. I'm just gonna place it on my eyeball. Let's soak in. I love the feeling of the cool water and oils on my eyes because I usually like just feel tired by the end of the night, so this refreshes them a little bit. So that's done put this one away this one is the all-in-one waterproof makeup remover um, for sensitive skin I usually always go for the ones that say sensitive skin because that's what I have okay so as you guys can see um, I have a few blemishes on my face I have had acne since I hit middle school as a kid. I have never ever been one of those people that just had the flawless, smooth, glowing skin. Um, that time of the month for me always, always guaranteed as a breakout for me. And depending on what I'm eating or doing, um, my face is just very sensitive. Sometimes it's super dry, especially in the winter, and sometimes it seems like it's super oily. I just have, my skin is usually all over the place. Whoops. So now that I am almost 30 um, and mommy life has kicked in, for the past couple years since I've become a mother, I have not taken care of my skin whatsoever. I usually fall asleep in my makeup. I'm totally guilty of that. Um, at the end of the night, I'm usually completely exhausted by the time I get home from work, make dinner, take care of the kids, put the kids down. I just want to 
hop in bed and watch a TV show, fall asleep, whatever. So my skin is usually the last thing that I think about. And for some reason over the last month, um, I just hated the way my skin looks in the morning. It's usually dry. Even if I take my makeup off in the morning before I reapply new makeup, it just, my makeup didn't look good on my face. And so for the past couple of weeks now, I've been taking way better care of my skin. I have a routine and I can just feel my skin feels smoother, softer, my makeup looks better. I overall just feel like my complexion looks better. Even though I still have breakouts, um, they seem to be less and well controlled. So first thing we're gonna do after cleaning our face is tone it. So I'm gonna grab my rose water. The only thing that's in this is rose and water. So um, it's very gentle on my skin and I just kind of spray it all over and then let it soak in. And I go down my chest a little bit too. My face looks kind of wet right now and it'll go away in a couple minutes once it all soaks into my skin. Okay, so it dries parts of my entire face is always like right here on my nose and right here for me. These parts get really dry so I always hit them really good with whatever I'm using, a serum, a moisturizer, whatever it is. So next we're going to go in with our vitamin C series from Teamy Blends. All I usually need is two pumps of the serum but if I feel like my face soaked it up really fast I'll go in for a third. Um, I like the feeling when I put products on my face that I can feel it like actually getting soaked into the skin and not just laying on top of my skin. And I can always feel the serum getting soaked right up into my skin. So we're just gonna do two little. We're just gonna do two pumps in our hand, and I warm it up just on the tip of my fingers, and then I just spread it all over my face in little circular motions. It goes on really smooth. I go down my neck, under my eyes. I don't know if you guys can see, but my skin I feel like already looks healthier, glowier, hydrated. That's what I like. I like my skin to feel hydrated. I go over my lips with it too because it feels like chapstick almost. So at first my face feels a little bit dewy almost. Usually after a couple minutes when it gets soaked in it, that dewiness kind of goes away and it just feels like really soft. I've been using it for a month and that's how much is gone. So this stuff lasts a really long time. You don't need a lot of it. It just feels so good on my skin. Okay, so for a little extra moisturizing coverage since we're going to sleep i like to add a little bit more so that when i'm laying in bed and while i'm sleeping overnight my face is just soaking up all those good nutrients in the morning i can wake up feeling like my face is really refreshed so we're going to add the aloe cream on top of the teamy brand on top of the teamy blends um facial serum I always keep my caps on these things. So we're just gonna take this off. This is what it looks like. It's kind of like, it definitely does not feel like moisturizer. It feels like, I don't know. It kind of looks like aloe to me, obviously, because it is aloe, but it goes on very clear and it's kind of, I don't know, even know what I would call it. So you only need a little of this because it definitely goes a long way. So I just took a little, again I'm going to warm it up on the tip of my fingers and then just in circular motions go over my entire face, my neck, under my eyes a little, I pat, 
I'm going to take a little bit more, get my forehead really good. I always rub the rest of my products into my hands because they just feel so good. Okay, so we're gonna put the top back on. Seal that up. I'm gonna comb out my eyebrows a little bit. Okay, so we're pretty much done here, mom life. I like things quick and easy. Actually, I usually don't even sit at my desk when I do this. I grab this, my micellar water, and my moisturizer if I need it, and I'm usually laying right in bed watching Grey's Anatomy or whatever my show is that I'm currently watching, doing this because I just like to relax at night. So, I gotta move you guys for a second. So the last thing I do is put on chapstick. This is the chapstick I've been using for about a year. It's just Vaseline, super easy, nothing fancy. I like this one that comes in a jar. I don't know why, I just feel fancy. <laughs> now that my hands are all lotion-y, we're gonna attempt to open it. I got it. This thing is definitely well loved. They sell them, um, at least at my Target, like right on the end cap near the makeup aisle. And I definitely need to get more. So I just take a little on my finger. This stuff again, a little goes a long way. I hate the feeling of dry lips, it annoys me. Okay, again, I rub it into my hands. My hands are very well moisturized. And that is pretty much it. Uh, I let all the goodness soak into my face overnight. I go relax, get a good night's sleep as much as I can being a mom. And I'm ready for the work week. I'm gonna take my hair out. I just go to bed exactly like this. I do not brush my hair at night. I know a lot of people that have blonde bleached hair like me always ask me how I keep it healthy. There's a couple things I feel like keep my hair a little bit more healthy and that is I definitely don't wash it as much. I try my best to use my Dove dry shampoo as much as I can until it's like the absolute dirtiest that it can get and then I definitely have to wash it. Um, when I wash it, I use a lot of conditioner and I let the conditioner sit in my hair for like five minutes while I do stuff in the shower. I don't just add conditioner then rinse. I let it soak up in the shower. Um, and then the other thing is, is I don't ever brush my hair when it's wet. Um, I feel like that can be sometimes damaging to the hair, especially if your hair is already brittle. So... I just go to bed with it right like this and I know that that's not ideal for every hair type but for me it works. I just go to bed right like this and in the morning my hair is a little beach wavy kind of and I brush right through it and I usually don't have a problem. I mean there's always snarls in it and everything but I just feel like it, it keeps my hair healthier not ripping through it when it's you know wet like this. So I just go to bed without even combing it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Thank you again to Teamy Blends for partnering with me on this video. Don't forget to check out their vitamin C facial serum. I'm gonna have the website and my discount codes linked down below for you guys if you wanna go check them out. Mwah. Love you all. Bye. Stumbling out of bed And I still got you in my head From all those pretty words you said It's like I'm wasted 
Every time I see your face I'm losing track of time and space I don't know where I am It's like I'm wasted And 